Welcome back to Tech Mimic, where you can simply view, imitate, replicate, and get on with your day. I recently ran into a situation where the desktop manager, in this case GNOME, refused to load, and to fix it, I had to download and install some things from the command line. As there was only wireless networking available, I had to connect my machine to the Wi Fi the hard way. That served as the inspiration for this video. I'm going to demonstrate how to configure wireless networking in Ubuntu strictly from the command line. Although I am using the terminal from inside the GNOME, it will work just the same from the real command line. Any existing Wi-Fi configuration was removed, and for the built-in Ethernet card on the motherboard, the network cable is unplugged for a proper test. So let's start from scratch. Check if there is a wireless network card available. List the networking devices with the command IP link show. WLP2S0 is the wireless card on this system. Make a note of your wireless card, as you will need this during the later commands. Replace it in the commands where applicable. To get a bit more details about wireless networking, type the command iwconfig. And to get even more information, use lshw. If it is not installed, install it with sudo apt install lshw, but that would require networking at this point. Something with a chicken and an egg. Then list all of the hardware for the network class, like the vendor and the model. sudo lshw dash capital C network. We are dealing with a Qualcomm network card in this system. Alternatively, use lspci pipe grep dash i network or use LSUSB if you are using a USB Wi-Fi device. After the various checks, it is clear the network card is available and eager to go. We will now have to create the network connection with Network Manager through the nmcli command. First check if Network Manager is running. sudo systemctl status network manager. It is listed as active running. If it is not, start with sudo systemctl start network manager. To check the current state of networking, type nmcli device status. Wi-Fi is down if the state reads unavailable. Let's enable the Wi-Fi card with the commands nmcli device set wlp2s0 or replace with your device, managed yes. And then the command nmcli radio Wi-Fi on. Check the networking state again with NMCLI device status. Now the state went from unavailable to disconnected. It is now time to connect to our Wi-Fi network. I am going to assume the network you want to connect to is broadcasting its network address. To list all of the Wi-Fi networks, NMCLI device Wi-Fi list. Here you can study the available Wi-Fi networks and check the transfer rates, the signal strength, the security protocol, and more. The last step is to actually connect to the Wi-Fi network. The command is sudo nmcli def Wi-Fi connect, then the network SSID, password, and then your network password. If there are any special characters or spaces in the SSID name, escape them with a backslash or hit the tab key. Just a quick tip. Another way is to simply use the BSID. This is what you would also do to connect to another channel or frequency that is not broadcasting its SSID. And if you don't want to reveal your password on screen, you can use the dash dash ask option. That's what I'm going to do, to use the BSID with the password mask. Type sudo nmcli dash dash ask def wi-fi connect and then the bsid and verify the networking state once again with nmcli device status the state has now updated to connect it alternatively you could type nmcli connection 
show dash dash active. Test the connectivity by picking a website or by downloading a packet. Ping www.youtube.com. Your Wi-Fi configuration will be saved by Network Manager between reboots. You can disconnect from and connect to Wi-Fi by using disconnect or connect. To disconnect, type NMCLI device disconnect WLP2S0 or your device and then NMCLI device status. Now you are disconnected from the Wi-Fi from the command line. And to connect to Wi-Fi again, simply type NMCLI device connect your device name and NMCLI device status. That's how to configure wireless networking from the command line in Ubuntu. That's it. Hope it helped. And if it did, please like the video and keep it up. Until next time. Bye.